As a scrum master, you might find yourself in situations where you are required to deal with one of your team members' bad attitude. If your team represents a car, then the bad attitude of one of your team members is like a flat tire. You and your team can't go anywhere until you fix it. So the question is, how do you fix someone's bad attitude? When I ask this question to people leaders and executives during coaching sessions, almost always, the answer that I get is along the lines of, oh, when this happens, we have a one-on-one -on -one with the person and then we ask that person to change their attitude. Now, let me ask you this question, the people who are watching this video. Is asking the other person to change their attitude the right approach? If you answered no, then you are on the right track. Research shows that as humans, we do not appreciate hearing negative comments about our attitude. Your attitude is the physical manifestation of your beliefs. You guard it, you defend and support it, you do not let anyone dare touch it, even if when you know that the other person is right. Am I right? Well, then what's the solution? How do we fix someone's attitude? And the answer is, you can't. You can fix a person's attitude, but there is hope. What you can fix is the person's behavior. You see, if you dig a little deeper, you will find that it's not their attitude that bothers us. What bothers us is their behavior. It's the tone of their voice, crossing of their arms, rolling of their eyes, and looking at their watches that bothers us. So, as a scrum master, the next time you find someone with a bad attitude, ask yourself what they're doing. How are they acting? What's that behavior that's projecting that bad attitude? Once you pinpoint that behavior, set up a one-on-one -on -one and talk to them about what it is that's coming across as negative. You can say something like, when you look at your watch, in the middle of a collaborative session, the team feels disconnected from you. I'm concerned that if you continue with this behavior, then this disconnection will grow to a point where the team will stop caring for what matters to you. So, we cannot change someone's attitude, but we can change their behavior. Try it and let me know how it goes. That's it for today's session. I'll see you in the next one. Till then, have fun.